Well, uh... Oh, welcome to the building. Oh, thank you. Maybe we can have coffee sometime. Oh, great. 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 <laughs> well, uh, bye. 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 <laughs> Should we have invited her for lunch? No, we're gonna start season two of Battlestar Galactica. <laughs> We already watched the season two DVDs. Not with commentary. <laughs> I think we should be good neighbors. Invite her over, make her feel welcome. We never invited Louis slash Louise over. <laughs> and that was wrong of us. We need to widen our circle. I have a very wide circle. I have 212 friends on MySpace. <laughs> yes, and you've never met one of them. That's the beauty of it. I'm gonna invite her over. I'll have a nice meal and chat. Chat? But we don't chat, at least not offline. Well, it's not difficult. You just listen to what she says and then you say something appropriate in response. To what end? Hi. Again. Hi. 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 Anyway, um, we brought home Indian food. And, um, I know that moving can be stressful, and, and I find that when I'm undergoing stress, that good food and company can have a comforting effect. Also, curry's a natural laxative, and I don't have to tell you that, you know, a clean colon is just one less thing to worry about. Leonard, I'm no expert here, but I believe in the context of a luncheon invitation, you might want to skip the reference to bowel movements. Oh, you're inviting me over to eat? Uh, yes. Oh, that's so nice. I'd love to. Great. So, what do you guys do for fun around here? Well, today we tried masturbating for money. 